Hello developers, welcome to DevKit Weekly. I'm Ken Briota, Editor-in-Chief at Embedded Computing Design, and this week on DevKit Weekly, we're going to take a look at the Kiwi 330 from Axiom Tech. This is the latest innovation from Kiwi Board and Axiom Tech in rugged edge and embedded computing and industrial technology. The Kiwi 330x86 single board computer is powered by Intel Alder Lake N processor, and it is tailored for efficiency, low power consumption, and multi-core performance. It's built on the Gracemont CPU architecture, and thanks to the Alder Lake N processors, it's set up to power AI applications, uh, enhance industrial automation, or ease the way through any high performance computing project. Now it has impressive memory and storage capabilities for its size with uh, onboard LP DDR5 RAM with up to 16 gigabytes and NVMe storage options of up to 512 gigs. So the Kiwi 330 gets you access to data fast and it makes multitasking simplicity itself. The Kiwi 330 offers tons of IO and connectivity options, including three USB type C ports for connecting the MIO modules, two USB 2.0 wafer connectors, an EDP connector for a 4K display, and an M2 key E2230 slot for Wi-Fi modules and AI accelerator cards. Now, I'm gonna go through these and point them out for you as best I can. We've got, as I showed you before, over here, we've got our USB-C ports. They're 3.2 USB, and uh, there's one for display. And uh, right here, we've got our uh, RTC battery and front panel right in there. Uh, we've got DIO right on this side. Uh, these are the M2 key E2230s over here. Uh, there's a USB 2.0 uh, hiding uh, right in there. Uh, we've got a fan connector right here on this side. This is the LPDDR5 right there and the EDP over here. And of course, on this side, you can see a 12 VDC power input. Uh, we've got lots of stuff here. I just want to point out that one of these USB-Cs is a vertical, so you can get to that. Um, and uh, on this side, we've got uh, the Intel Atom processor right here in the middle. And uh, over here is the NVMe SSD. So there is a ton going on on this little board. The Kiwi 330 is built for versatility, performance, and reliability. Its small form factor and wide range of optional upgrades and modularity make it perfect for tons of applications from industrial automation to AI development. If you're trying to be the next Nikola Tesla or just to solve today's embedded computing or IoT challenges, the Kiwi 330 can help. If you want to find out more about the Kiwi 330, you can visit Axiom Tech at the link in the description. And if you want to win one of your very own, Axiom Tech has generously made one available for you to grab. All you have to do is enter our raffle to win one. So you go to the link in the description and fill out the form, and we will keep the form up for 30 days, and then you'll be notified by email if you win. Simple as that. Please like and share this video and make sure that you're subscribed so you never miss an episode of any of our shows, including DevKit Weekly. To keep up with all the news in Embedded, make sure you visit us every day at embeddedcomputing.com and follow us on all our socials. You'll find those links also down in the description doobly-doo. That's all for this edition of DevKit Weekly. I've been Ken Briota with Embedded Computing Design. And as always, thank you so much for watching and we will see you on the next episode of DevKit Weekly.